This is Sonic, and you're watching JD Frank 20. Yes, your eyes are not deceiving you. Yuji Naka is back, apparently. Here's his tweet right here, translated. Square Enix's Dragon Quest manager, Miyoki, has been transferred to Boo's business. It feels like it's finally happening. I hope he'll be gone soon because he's the kind of person who submitted a memo with lies, with evidence to court. I've never met him, but the new president seems like a good person. Yes, I have the entire article right here. I'll get to that in a quick moment. But Yuji Naka, apparently he's back. Now, all of this, I don't know what it can mean. Maybe Yuji Naka is just gaslighting. Maybe he's venting his frustrations because of what happened recently with the whole, you know, insider trading scandal at Square Enix. He's still vengeful about that, you know. And ironically, the name Dragon Quest came up. And you know that, that uh, there was some collusion between Yuji Naka and the uh, former manager right there. So, you know... You know, he wanted to vent his frustrations right there, and it kind of makes sense when you think about it. You know, I mean, there's one thing about Yuji Naka that he's very good at is he's good at playing the victim. Whether that being, you know, the way he was let go at Sega, you know, all of his other business ventures, he refuses to take any accountability. Yeah, so according to the article that uh, Yuji Naka was talking about is this one. Mr. Miyuke, the person in charge of Square Enix's Dragon Quest is transferred to straighten the company. It has been stated that uh, he's been in charge of the uh, Dragon Quest series for Square Enix for some time now, but it's been transferred and left his position. According to multiple sources, Miyake has been appointed as the head of a newly established studio that handles games for smartphones that was implemented as part of the large-scale organization reconstruction that, looked, uh, that took place on April 1st. A Square Enix spokesperson declined to comment when contacted by Bloomberg. Square Enix has faced questions from users in the market participants regarding the quality of its games and the number of copies sold led by Takashi Kuryu, who took over as president last year. The company is currently undergoing a fundamental review of its game development system. By reviewing the system, we will evaluate the organization and help boost sluggish sales. Yuji Naka is not going to be the kind of person who's going to admit to his faults. He's not going to be humble. You know, he refuses to change. I honestly think he's the kind of person who's going to try to backstab anybody just to try to get ahead. That's the kind of person he is, unfortunately. That's why I always keep stating over and over again, don't meet your heroes. You know, now again, I don't know what this what this means. I mean, Yuji Naka, you know, I honestly thought he was in jail, but in reality, he was probably under house arrest. So again, he's just venting his frustrations, but hey, at least he's back on social media. So basically, Yuji Naka could, be, could just be gaslighting right now, because why not? That's what everyone's doing. So why should he be any different? Let me know what you all think, and I gotta go. Peace out.